Hello and welcome to Old Lady Plays. I'm Kate, the old lady, and this is Sunshine on Leith, episode 74. You'll notice a slight change to our opening screen here. I've added in the trophies we've won. That's one league, three league or three cups, and one league cup. So let's see if we can do the treble this year and add one to each of those. Hell, let's make it a quadruple. We'll win the Champions League as well. Why not? Let's do that. Okay. Anyway, after that fantasy time, um, I'm going to get over to the game where today we are playing a double header with Dundee United. Then I'll play Falkirk offline and we get back with Tottenham. It'll be interesting to see how I feel about playing at White Hart Lane. Well, new White Hart Lane. Tottenham Stadium, whatever they're calling it these days. Um, it's new White Hart Lane to me. Um, I will be uh, playing that one after the Dundee United match. So, Dundee United are in fact in the championship, although they're doing fairly well there. Um, we're going with kind of a mixed up team. This isn't my A team or my B team. Um, it's kind of a mixed up bunch. Um, a lot of the A team players are in it because um, we have the Falkirk match and then the Tottenham match, so we want to make sure that they're all fit for the um, for the Tottenham match. But um, actually, I'm going to bring on Keck for Porteous, only because I want to make sure that I have Keck for the Tottenham match. Um, Anyway, that should do it. Our team is, as you can see, Brotveit, Crane, Keck, Salazar, and Brown, Poyet behind McGinn, Toyama, and Melendo, and look at that web of connections. Smith behind Huselius. Oh, we've actually played enough that they've gotten a bit of a connection. That's good. All right, let's roll. Um, I think I've forgotten to show you Gordon Liveston again. I'm sorry about that. I will show you after the game. Let's um, relax and play your natural game. Oh, get out of it. Fine, if you're demotivated, show me what you got tonight. Nope. His attitude has become problematic. I wish somebody would make a proper bid for him so I could reasonably sell him, but I'm not selling him for three million or four million. It's just not on. It's a five-star prospect, and I'm not giving him away cheap to some top team who will immediately turn around and make him worth 15, 20 million. Smith, oh, taken off him by Rogers. Not a lot happening in this first half so far. Keck to McGinn to Toyama. Hesalius back to Toyama. McGinn. Hesalius, nice try. Off the post and out. Hmm, not much going on. We're getting some shots, but we're not getting anything penetrating. Lots of possession. Yeah, 70% possession, but we can't seem to break through. See if we can get something out of these boys. Alright, 
his alias isn't working out. Don't know why, but he's not getting the job done today, so Chinouth comes in. Yes, let's go. Oh, and he took a knock anyway, so... I don't have Archer, so I can't move anybody to take care of Crane's spot. I don't like having this many yellow cards on the field. Um, if I bring on Porteous for Salazar, and I don't have directly a defensive midfielder, that's not good. Can you play there? Yes. Deep line playmaker, yes. You can come up here and be an advanced playmaker. That's fine. It's not ideal, but I'll take it. And that gets two of the yellow cards off the field. Come on, boys. Korach. Oh, that's nice. No! Res rescued, rescued, rescued. But he stayed off the field. Why did you stay off the field? Ugh. Melendo. Cross. Oh, Chenowth. It's usually better than that. This is very disappointing. Extra time. Charming. That's what I want to see. have completely dominated the match. They've had one long shot that was off target. And of course I took off Diego Poyet, who's our best penalty taker. Because of course I did. Come on, boys. Brown with a nice interception. Korac through for Chenowth. Can he get through on goal? He did. Didn't finish it. Keeps the ball in but gives it away. We're going to go overload for the last five minutes here. I really don't want to have to go to penalties. Oh my goodness. <sighs> oh, we're trying it. What the hell? Nothing. Yeah, I know he's tired. Yikey poos. I'll let the players pick themselves. Nice play. Nice penalty. Toyama with a good one sends him the wrong way. Evened up. Come on, Per. That's my man. Turns aside a dreadful penalty. 
All right, Janath. In you go, Lucas. Bang, that's my boy. Give me another one, Power. Yeah, that's my boy. Good job, good job. Pretty much got them on the ropes here, but mm, that's not going to help. McGinn doesn't miss many. Wrong way. To all, Smith with the chance to take the lead. Got it. And they have to score to stay in it. All right, one more save pair and we're through. Yes! Three saves in the shootout. That's a goalkeeper for you. And he's our backup, okay? He's our backup goalkeeper. Dun da da da. Good enough for that. Oh, I'm going to say it was a good win. It should have been done in regular time, but I'm not going to complain about uh, a great finish. Bernina through the League Cup quarterfinal. Woohoo! Uh, um, he's a good player. Don't have any choice of who I want in the next round. No, I really don't want to say who I want in the next round. Okay, so I will be back in a few moments for the Tottenham match. See you then. Welcome back. It's time for the Tottenham match, but first we're going to take a second and look at the Premiership because hooray, we are in first place by a goal difference, but we are in first place. Rangers has dropped off a little bit. Um, they just got beaten by Kilmarnock. Um, Hearts has dropped off a little bit. They drew with Hamilton. So things are things are looking up for us. Um, how have we done? We did 4-3 against Motherwell. I didn't show that to you. Um, but yeah, it was 4 nothing in the first half and they came back with 3 in the second half. So, woo, not so ideal. I had some rollicking things to say for them, for about, for to them about that one. Um, uh, you saw the Dundee United match. Falkirk, we beat them 2-0. Quite handy, no problem. A couple of goals in the first. Easy pie. And in doing so, we've moved up to the Scottish... Excuse me, the first place in the Scottish Premiership. Now, there's one player I want to show you, because I keep talking about him, but I haven't shown him to you yet, I don't think. And that is Gordon Liveston, um, whom we brought in from Motherwell. Um... He's uh, he's a good-looking young player. Look at the flair, passing, technique. His vision is great. Um, you know, I look at him as being a real um, a real playmaker sort. So um, he may develop into the playmaker on the on the B team for now. But uh, he's he's pretty good. He's pretty good. I'm I'm really pleased with this purchase. Um, we got him fairly cheap. 2.8 million. He's worth one and a half. So we overpaid a little bit, but that's not too bad. Oh, I thought we got him from Motherwell. We got him from Aberdeen. My mistake. Um, anyway, as you can see, the team is Ripley, Archer, Keck, Kutsi, Brown, Poyet with McGinn, Korach, and Melendo, Smith behind Cotton up front. And we'll see how we get on. Cotton has eight goals in his six starts, so that's not bad. He's off to a off to a bit of a flyer, but now let's see how we get on against the mighty Tottenham Hotspur. Of course, I think they're mighty because you know they're my team, they're my boys. I love them. 
I wonder how many of them that I actually recognize here. Harry Kane, for some reason, playing on the wing. Casper Dolberg's there. Dele Alli. Uh, Alderweireld. <laughs> and Lloris is still there. My goodness, he's got to be like 40, 35. He's still pretty darn good. Um, yeah, who else is there on the bench? Anybody I recognize? Uh, Christian Eriksen. Davinson Sanchez. And that's it. Okay. I was just curious. I know they also have Dyer and Rose, but they're not available for this match. So, that's okay. Here we are. It's time to go. Prove a point today. I think we go here. Alright, we got a few of them. Um, we're going to have to be at our very best. We are away today, so any team would miss a player of his caliber. Let's see how we can do this. Like I said, we managed to play them pretty evenly in the um, preseason. They did win, but only barely. And we outshot them and outpossessed them, so... Um, you know, preseason, take it for what it's worth, but... Keck with a good clearance. McGinn, Poyet, Brown, Smith, through ball, but Cotton wasn't going. Oops, there you go. Poyet with a good tackle. Ugh. Passing is not doing the best. That's bad, yep. <sighs> well, we didn't expect we'd win them all. But we'll see. We went down 1 0 to Porto as well, so. <sighs> Come on, play it. Get the ball to somebody. Oy All the way back to the keeper. And outside the box, too. Good ball. Archer. Keck. Getting closed down. Archer. They're just kind of playing with fire here a little bit. Kutzi. Out for Brown. Brown's got the ball and runs with it. Gets it inside for Korach. Korach for Cotton. Cotton. Oh, cannot quite beat Loris. But we're playing them pretty even. The possession is similar. We've got more shots. We're committing a lot more fouls, but... Over the bar. Yes! Cotton gets the goal and we're back in it. What a beauty. And we're back on top of the group, which is just crazy. <laughs> Look how tired they are. Ooh, I hadn't noticed that. They got players in the 60s already and we're in the first half. Oh, what a tackle. Whew. Well, I gotta say, if we could get out of here with a draw, I'd be very pleased. I got a few of them, but not all. Nobody there. 
mountains that are to nobody. Okay, who have I got to replace Cammy Smith? I don't actually have anybody. Um, that's annoying. Should I go to two up front? Why not? We'll try it. Let's see how it works out. Um, anybody else need to come off? Doesn't look like it just yet. I think we'll leave it at that one for now. How old is Erickson now? Oh, it won't show me. Oh, they've got Angel Carrera as well. All right, uh, time for a change or two. Let's have Archer for Crane and McGeech for Melendo. Maybe McGeech can come up with one of his screamers from the top of the box. That's what he's good at. Korach finds Cotton, finds Chinouth. Gets to Brown. Brown through, back to Chenelth. Knocked down for Korach, now wide for Crane. Back inside, can't get it there. But McGeech finds Cotton with an incredible pass, and we're up. Oh my goodness. Cotton's tenth goal of the season, and we are up. This is crazy talk. Oh, well-timed run by Cotton, and then a fantastic finish. My goodness. Oh, talk about a smash and grab. This would be the smashiest, grabbiest win. Uh-oh, bad back pass. Chinouth. It's in! 3-1, just like Porto. Oh my goodness! Chinouth's 50th goal for us. Which isn't bad, because he's been with us just over two years. That was just a terrible back pass. And Lloris really should have done better. That was not a very hard shot. and Yeah. Glory, glory to the hippies. Sorry, not hippies, hybies. Hybies is the team, hippies is the fans, I think. At least that's the divide between the two words. I'm not sure that I have it right as to which one's which, but... Glory, glory to the hibs. That'll do. 3-1. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, what a comeback. That was outrageous. The question of whether Cotton could do it on the big stage. Well done. <laughs> not, re not prepared to answer the question. Uh, tough one, Potch. Cotton's performance, absolutely, you were superb, thank you, good, all well, and there we go, we will be back for the Wolfsburg and Motherwell matches, so that's where we'll be um, back for Thursday's match, Thursday's episode, I should say, um, and we won't know for sure what happens after that unless, until we know what happens in the Motherwell match, because the League Cup when, when is the League Cup final? Schedule, uh, quarterfinal, semifinal. 
League final is the 27th of November. That's way down here. So it won't be that. Maybe we'll play Rangers and Wolfsburg or Celtic and Wolfsburg. We'll figure it out. For today, though, it's going to be um, two good wins. I'm, I'm very pleased. I can't believe we needed penalties to get past Dundee United, but we did. And we beat Tottenham. I am absolutely jazzed about this. So let's drop a like for a great episode, I think. Hit subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you very much for your time. I appreciate it. I hope you're having a great day and take care.